Our programs include many languages. Please log on to our program schedule for more details. SupremeMasterTV.com forward slash schedule. Nos programmes comprennent des émissions en plusieurs langues. Pour de plus amples informations, consultez SupremeMasterTV.com barre oblique schedule. Chương trình của chúng tôi gồm nhiều ngôn ngữ. Xin vui lòng xem lịch phát sóng để biết thêm chi tiết. SupremeMasterTV.com gạch chéo schedule. It's not about Italy or Italian people, you know, it's about the principle of life that they uphold. It's about loving kindness, ethical treatment of human and animals. It's about their culture. It's about the, the nice and humane culture that I'm talking about. Okay? Every country should be like that, or even more. Please continue watching to find out more. Supreme Master Ching Hai's lectures are not a complete meditation instruction. Please do not try alone. For free of charge guidance, please visit godsdirectcontact.org or contact any of our centers near you. Today's episode will be presented in English with subtitles in Arabic, Arlaxis, also known as Vietnamese, Bulgarian, Croatian, Chinese, Czech, English, French, German, Hindi, Hungarian, Indonesian, Italian, Japanese, Korean, Malay, Mongolian, Persian, Polish, Portuguese, Punjabi, Romanian, Russian, Spanish, and Thai. Hãy subscribe cho kênh Ghiền Mì Gõ Để không bỏ lỡ những video hấp dẫn. Tôi Hong Kong is 260個美麗的島嶼組成。這個地名源自香港南區的石牌灣。翻譯過來就是芳香的港口。香港擁有世界最自由的貿易市場、國際貿易在其經濟上扮演了重要的角色。維多利亞港是國際最繁忙的港口之一, 好榮幸與你分享歡樂的香港剪影這位完全開悟的名師傳授觀音法門為他人無私奉獻
青海无上师表示深深感谢挚爱嘅上帝，多年嚟有各界提供财力、物力、人力、心力，降济灾民同困苦嘅人，参与各项先行义举，并成为上帝嘅工具，向佢嘅宝贵子女传达慈悲同爱。二零零六年，佢获颁孤士和平奖，此奖等同东方嘅诺贝尔和平奖。佢卓越嘅人道善行，多年嚟获颁无数奖项，博得世人无数赞誉。佢努力为动物发声，提倡和平爱心嘅植物飲食。佢更许下愿景，希望人类领悟众生皆神圣，缔造和平辉煌嘅纯素世界，动物同人类共存共荣。佢以各种方式倡导纯素生活，例如广发传单，你也可以选择这样的生活。创设爱家国际连锁纯素餐厅同无上司电视台，佢亦经常呼吁政府同媒体领袖，并参加气候变迁视讯会议，无论世人是否警觉。其努力影响世人之具，唤醒人们选择善待动物嘅生活，并奉行慈悲之道，天下才能永久和平，救地球免于气候变迁。青海无上师多年嚟足迹遍布全球，从美国到非洲、欧洲到大洋洲，对大众同佢嘅徒弟。讲经开示苏百祥，禅释各种灵性主题。今日有幸为你播出一场精辟嘅视讯会议，主题系师徒之间节目，行为思想高贵，一心只要上帝。十二集之十，二零一四年九月十五日，以英文开示于美国加州洛杉矶。And another thing, if you go to Italy, any tourists, you know, I'm telling it to all the tourists to go to Italy and in the future. If you are vegetarian, vegan, and you just tell any waiter and waitress that you are vegan, vegetarian, they they are so happy. They smile at you and say, "Oh, yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Okay,、uh, no meat, no egg, right? Okay, we make it right away for you. You wait here, something like that. You know, they never question why is that, why you don't eat meat and all that." Italian, no, no. And if you speak English or French, because you're foreigner, they speak French to you. They speak English to you. They even speak German to you. <laughs> you know, and not all of them, but they will try. At least they speak English to you. All of them like that. Wow. You know, the waiter and waitress in Italy, even they treat you like like royalty, truly like that, and they take their job seriously and lovingly. And sometimes, even sometimes, I go to a restaurant to to meet someone and all that, and for a job, and even they make the salad, just salad, you know, mixed salad. It tastes heavenly. They have special vinegar that put in the salad, and、uh, their olive oil is fantastic. We just mix the two of them, a little salt, and it tastes heavenly. But it's because of their love from the chef, I think. And every restaurant is the same. I thought it's just that restaurant, but the other restaurant the same. Oh. Just a salad, you know.、Yeah, you can buy、it. from supermarket and go home and mix it with,、uh, cut a few pieces of tomatoes and put the vinegar and olive oil and a little salt. It. it tastes like heaven. And when I'm home, I thought, okay, from now on, I eat like this. <laughs> I made it. It's not the same. <laughs> I don't know why. It's truly not the same. So I told one of my, you know, assistant. I say, look at that. The other day, I invited you. In the restaurant, and they just give us the salad that is bought from a supermarket with a few slices of tomato on it, and then it was so good, right? Remember? He said, "Yes, yes, it was so good." And I came home, made the same next day. It <laughs> don't taste the same. <laughs> Maybe different vinegar or something. They have special vinegar, balsamic vinegar tastes so good. Yes, master.
Uh, yeah, okay. This is about Italy, yeah? This is about the, the, the people, you know. I think the people, they're so loving, so kind. Very, very kind people. And I was told, you know, that Italy is one of the highest producers of organic vegan. Oh. And the, uh, the number of the vegan people are very, very high as well. My God, no wonder, no wonder. Yeah. Wow, amazing. And you know the, the company called Vegusto that make vegan cheese? Yes, it's selling thy hot cake in Italy because it's so easy to sell in Italy. A, a lot of vegan people, a lot of people uh, are vegan in Italy. I bump into vegan people everywhere. Even in supermarket, you know, normal supermarket, they will show you, okay, I'm vegan, or my daughter's vegan, and my sister vegan, my wife vegan, wherever I go. Wow. Either their wife vegan, or their daughter vegan, or they are vegan, and they just help me to find a vegan product in a normal supermarket when there is, when I don't know where the bio shop is, or too far for me to go. I just ask them, and they would stand there, you know, long hours, long, long time, you know, to read the ingredients for me and tell me this one no this one yes this one no this one yes so honest and so helpful and so loving even if they are not vegan themselves they would help you that's italian people so nice so patient so loving and i haven't met any italian who who has not been kind to me you, you know just to be reminded that San Francis of Assisi, he was vegetarian, well-known, yeah? Yes, Master. And he loves animals. Everybody knows that. The whole world knows that. And the Italian people, they love him. Maybe that's why it's ingrained in their culture to be kind to animals. Oh, I see. And also, you know, if, you're, if people are kind to animals, they normally are kind also to humans. That's what is he said, you know? If you love animals, you would love humans too. And I'm happy, I'm happy for the Italian people. Thank you, San Francis of Assisi. Alternative Living Change your life, change your heart, change your diet. No more killing. Be healthy and loving. Examples of nutritious, life-saving food, percentage by weight. Tofu from soya, 16% protein concentration. Gluten from flour, 70% protein concentration. Corn, 13% protein concentration. Rice, 8.6% protein concentration. Soybeans, kidney beans, chickpeas, lentils, etc. 10 to 35% protein concentration. Almonds, walnuts, cashews, hazelnuts, pine nuts, etc. 14 to 30 percent protein concentration. Pumpkin seeds, sesame seeds, sunflower seeds, etc. 18 to 24 percent protein concentration. Concentrated multivitamin tablets or capsules are also a good source of vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. Fruits and vegetables are full of vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants and contain high-quality fiber for maintaining good health and a long life. The recommended daily allowance, 50 grams of protein, average adult. Calcium from vegetables is more absorbable than from cow's milk. To diminish the real threat of a worldwide pandemic from bird flu. To avoid the danger of mad cow disease, or BSE, and pig disease, or PMWS, etc to stop the continuing gruesome sacrifice of billions of our sweet domestic animals, marine life, and feathered friends daily. It's wise to change to a vegan diet for good. It's health. It's economy. It's ecology. It's compassion. It's peace. It's noble. For more information and free veg recipes, please refer to the websites listed below. al.godsdirectcontact.org, vrg.org, vegsource.com. Or email to al at godsdirectcontact.org. Okay, one of my dogs is, uh, of course, they are all old now. One of my dogs are having trouble. Yeah. 
You remember she eat the live insect, even though I feed her ve- vegetarian or vegan before. Yes, master. And other dogs don't do that. Only her do that. So she has trouble, you know, m- more than other dogs. And then we went to to some vet in one country. I don't want to mention, of course. But then we brought her to Italy. And they treat her right away. They never question. They know how old she is. And I say, she's also a vegan doctor. So make sure uh, that uh, if you can, uh, please uh, treat her with vegan uh, medicine. She said, I know. I know everything. I know everything. Don't worry. Oh, my God. It's so nice. And they, they never say, it's too old. Why bother? What? Why bother? What kind of talk is that? My dogs are precious to me. Even if she live one more day, she should live in happiness and health. Right, Master. It's not about her die, dying or not, about life and death. It's about pain. She should not live in pain. That's why we want to treat her. And she's okay now. She's happy and wonderful now. What mean old? How old is old? Huh? Yes, Master. And, and that doctor, you know, because this is a special treatment. So they have to travel to Italy in a special clinic in Bologna. And I only can talk to her through telephone. My assistant bring her there and stay for a while until she's done. And I only talk to the doctor on the phone and she was so friendly already. She said, I know, I know, I know. You adopted her. You're such a good person. We will treat her like our own. Oh. You know, and I say, yes, thank you, doctor. And thank you, doctor. And uh, tomorrow is the last treatment. So I tell my assistant to bring you some gift uh, for you and all your assistant and even to your cleaner. Please accept and save it for them. Please accept. Uh, I know you don't need it. Uh, it's just our token of gratitude. Please accept it. And, uh, and she said, oh, yeah, thank you, thank you. That's very nice of you, very nice of you. But we are doing our job, uh, whether or not. I said, yes, I know that, but I'm really grateful to you. And she accepts it. And then when they bring the gift, they, she's, they just accept it all. They don't say anything. They were just so happy, happy. They said, wow. We never had so much, you know, so big gift before. <laughs> yes, it's wonderful people. They're so gracious. Oh, yeah. And uh, I'm talking about the cleaner in that clinic. The doctors, they clean the clinic themselves. Wow. To make sure that everything clean. They don't hire a cleaner because it's a special treatment. You know, you, you have only one, one of that in Italy. They don't have one in uh, some other country. don't even have one. Some neighboring country don't have one. In Italy, they have one in Bologna. And the doctors even clean the clinic themselves. So they say, I don't have cleaner. We, <laughs> we clean. Uh-huh. And my assistant saw it. They say, yeah, they clean it themselves. There's no cleaner here. <laughs> I see, Master. Imagine that. Such humble doctors. They've been taught well in Italy. No wonder I'm told that in Italy to, to pass a doctor license is very, very difficult. Uh, you know, there are many other things, else, but I probably forget. But I think it's enough about Italy and Italian people. I don't know them. I don't know any of them. Prime Minister of Italy is the only one that wrote me a little hand note. And uh, I thank him for that. He's, he's so humble. You know, I'm nobody and he even wrote me a hand note. Just, <laughs> he's so nice. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Italy. I'm so happy for Italy. May God bless your people forever. May your country improve more and more and be favorable in every aspect. Your people happy, your country prosper, and your government getting better and better all the time. Thank you, Italy, for being so loving and kind. I love Italy. Yes. We love them too. (laughs) (laughs) Yes. And the Italian prime minister, I'm sure, is good for Italy. You know, I'm glad for Italy that he came up. Yeah? Mm. Yes, Master. Even though he wrote me a hand note, I also did not know him personally, so do not think that I have anything to do with him. Or that he tell me to talk good about Italy or Canada even. Okay? I mostly don't know any politician personally. I see, Master. Yeah, it's not about Italy or Italian people. You know, it's about the principle of life that they uphold. It's about loving kindness, ethical treatment of human and animals. 
It's about their culture. It's about the, the nice and humane culture that I'm talking about. Okay, every country should be like that, or even more. Yes, master. Yeah, yeah, should be more. We we could never have enough love, right? There's no such thing as too much love, right? Okay. Yes, master. Thank you, Master. You're welcome. Anything else? Yes, Master. Master, we've been seeing also a lot of very um, encouraging vegan news around the world. Yes. For example, a study in Sweden found that one in ten Swedish people are vegetarian or vegan. Wow. Yes. Bless the country, Sweden. Bless Swedish people. Yes. Yes, Master. Oh, wow. So that's that's very encouraging, and also, encouraging, Master. Encouraging. Yes. Yes, yes. Uh, also many um, big celebrity superstars, Master, have converted to the vegan diet. Yes. Um, for example, we have uh, actress Michelle Pfeiffer and Kate Michelle Mara. Michelle Pfeiffer? Yes, Master, oh. has converted to the vegan diet. Uh, Kate Mara, also singer Ariana Grande. Oh, wow. And a ver the very famous actor Samuel L. Jackson, Master, who's, yeah. who has converted to vegan as well. Wow. And he said that he lost 40 pounds after going vegan. Wow. Tell and si singer Ellie Golding, um, and she said that her voice improved yes? after going vegan. Yeah, of and, course. And um, also, Master, former U.S. Vice President Al Gore has also recently got become vegan last um, in November last year, Master. Wow, and Clinton, huh? President Clinton, right? Yes. Yes, Master, so that makes the two of them, and Al Gore as well, wow, more recently. Wow, two president already vegan. And I think uh, President Obama and his wife also kind of vegan or something? Because they sense... Yes, Master, they, they, they promote is, uh, yeah. the, the healthy diet yeah, yeah. And, and gardening as well, organic, yeah. very much into organic food, Master. Yes. And they send, the, the, they send their cook to Korea temple to learn, to learn cooking, Korean style, and uh, Korean temple means wow. <laughs> vegetarian, at least vegan, you know? The, the monks, wow. they don't, the Korean monks, they don't eat meat. They, they are yes, vegetarian, master. vegan, yes. <laughs> Something wow. like that, yeah. That's very hopeful. There are more people who are vegetarian or vegan in Sweden. It's just they did not always tell, you know. So the the number, the you know, the ten percent is not always correct. Yes. Many people now yes. are they vegan? They just don't say. Yeah. Okay. Yes, master. Uh, Mister, what, Mister, the Virgin Airline. Richard Branson? Uh, yeah. Yes, that's right, Master. Sir Richard Branson. Yeah, you didn't know. He also wrote in his blog that he's going. He say he's forego red meat because, because, because. Oh, wonderful. But I think uh, behind that, he's going vegan. <laughs> or, gone yes. ve or gone vegan already. Great to hear, you know, Master. Be sometimes people in a higher position, they are more cautious about telling what they do. Because, uh, you know, yes. they think they have a, uh, how we say, a uh, name to keep. But being vegan is, is you know, precious. It's glorious. It should be open yes, to everyone course, to follow. You know, good example. If you are in a leading position, a more so you have to tell when you do good things. Being vegan is compassionate. It's environmental friendly, you know, and it's wise. It's healthy, it's intelligent choice. According to, you know, research and intelligent people, uh, vegetarian or vegan. So just join yes, the master. club. I don't know why people are hiding. They should come out and tell that they're vegan. Anyone. <laughs> Soon. Yes, definitely, yeah. Master. Well, actually, the big Hollywood movie Noah, it had an all-vegan premiere party. Oh, wow. And the media was a buzz about the main character, Noah, uh, being yeah. a vegan, and the film's director, Darren Aronofsky, possibly being a veg. Wow. Yes, Master, and there was also coverage of celebrity vegan weddings. Uh -huh. um, for yeah, example, Anne Hathaway's, Natalie Portman's, Persia White's, and Sarah Gilbert's. Yes. 
they've had big celebrity vegan weddings master and it seems to be becoming quite a trend yeah. in Hollywood. So that's also encouraging. Yes, many more. They just didn't want to say because they think it's their private things. But if they are celebrity, then they are people of the public. They're not private people. So they should all go out and tell. Hmm? <laughs> My opinion. Yes, master. Okay. It's, it's spread all over the news, master. So yeah. that's very hopeful. Wonderful, wonderful. Um, as also, as um, some very famous movie directors are also vegan now, Master. Yeah. For example, uh, Latsi Hallström, who is the, the director of Chocolat and The Cider House Rules and, and a few other very famous movies. Wow. And he also introduces himself on his Twitter profile wow. um, that he's a vegan. Wow. Um, so Wonderful. he's coming out yeah. into the public, Master, which is good. Wonderful. Um, and also James Cameron, the famous movie director, his wife, yeah. um, has a school in, in Malibu in California. And um, they are, in, at the moment, transitioning the school to become completely vegan. Wow. Bless them. Yes. Bless all these people and celebrities who are so wise. Wise choice. That's right. Bless them. May heaven bless them. Manifold. <laughs> and I bless them. If I have any blessing, I give them blessing. <laughs> Yes, tell me, love. Thank you, Master. Also, um, Sir Paul McCartney, um, he has recently had a big concert in August and he ordered it to, to be completely vegan. Yes. And even the audience weren't allowed to bring their own meat inside the stadium. Wow. That is what I call real action. <laughs> yes, Master. Bravo. Bless him. Mm. Yes, Master. Thank you, Master.人慈的觀眾感謝你觀賞今日的司徒之間節目行為思想高貴一心只要上帝十二集之十請鎖定無上司電視台收睇更多精妙的節目焦點新聞後將播出智慧之語聖希德加逢賓根來自天上的遠見